Hey, everybody. We're live at Pace Studios in New York right now, and uh, we are live with Dopapod. Guys, thanks for being here. Thanks Thank for you. having us. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we are We're going to share three songs today. Two of them are off of Emit Time, which congratulations, by the way, because that uh, exists out in the world right now. It just came out May 24th. Um, and one of them is from Never Otter, even the 2014 album, I believe. That sounds true to me as I say it. And uh, But three songs are happening today. Uh, can you tell us what you're going to do first? Uh, this one is... The one that you mentioned from Never Out or Even, it's called Present Ghosts.
Thank you, guys. And it's a great start to the Monday morning. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, can we talk a little bit about the what the songwriting looked like on this album, on Unimit Time, versus what it's looked like in, uh, in, in previous efforts before this one? Don't look at me. <laughs> yeah, go, Eli. <laughs> well, I think on this new album, um, it's, it was really like more of a group effort than it's ever been in the past. And on all different songs... Um, it was like there was one song that you know, you got Chuck wrote the whole thing, which was you know, like a first for us. And the songwriting roles really were spread around to everybody in the band. So I think it made for a more, um, you know, eclectic kind of kind of album, which is, you know, it's cool. Yeah. Yeah, it is. I agree, man. I enjoy it. I enjoy what you guys are doing here today. We're looking forward to two off of Emit Time coming up. Um, also, do you feel like when, uh, so it was Philly and Denver, right? That were the yeah. two cities where this was recorded. And do you feel like the vibe of those two places influenced what was happening? Or do you feel like it would have sounded like the same record regardless of uh, where you recorded it? Yeah, I don't think that really had anything to do with it. Um, we just, you know, happen to live there now, but. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the like altitude out there kind of, I think, affects us a little bit sometimes. But uh, but while we were rec- well, w- I feel like we wrote the songs and arranged them in Denver and recorded them in Philly. Yeah. yeah. And uh, but while we were rehearsing in Denver, we were pretty much just locked in a room with no windows, so we could have been anywhere. You know, yeah. we could have been in Iowa for all we knew. You True. know. Yeah. And there was not a lot of oxygen in that room, which made for. <laughs> Some interesting feelings <laughs> at times. Well, I am looking forward to uh, to what's coming up next. You guys are going to do two from Emit Time. Can you tell us what you're going to do uh, first? I think we're going to start off with the first track from the album called Numbers Need Humans. And then I'm not sure what we're doing. Which we'll, but yeah, we can figure we'll that get out. To that. Yeah. We'll get to that. All right. One step at a time. All right. So this is one. This one's called Numbers Need Humans. <laughs>
Yeah. All right. Thank you, guys. Um, so you were, there was some some time off of touring, which which uh, recommenced with that with the show, which by all accounts was outstanding at the Capitol. There's a lot of comments right now in the Facebook comment section. People who were at that show are completely stoked on what you guys did. Um, can we talk about the the importance of letting off the gas for a second? And I mean, I think all of us know that rest is important, but what, what were the, some of the specific uh, things that happened for you guys that you were able to sort of um, to, to come back together with a, with a new perspective on these tunes and creating mid time? I can't speak for the other guys, but I like actually have a life outside of being on tour now. Well done. <laughs> you know? Which was not the case earlier or it was hard le- to, le- lesser you know? the case, maybe less the case. Yeah. yeah. Um, that makes it that much more enjoyable when we do go out and play, because it sort of if, when we were doing as much as we did it before, it was pretty like life or death. It felt like, like we need to keep doing this. This is what we do. This is our life, you know. And now when we do it, it's just this like we're running off with the circus for a couple of days, kind of. Yeah. You know? like what are you, what are you up to in your life? Are you are you into now transcendental meditation and disc golf perchance? Are you a uh, what, are, Man, what are you up you to? Man, you got couldn't have guessed more wrong, <laughs> but. Uh, <laughs> No, I, I moved to Vermont. I live in Burlington. It's great. I don't know. Yeah. I go running and exercise a lot, which like two years ago I'd have like a cupcake and be like making fun of anybody who did that. <laughs> and uh, and so that's important to me and just, you know, hanging out with people. It's also like hard to make friends when you're on tour. I have these guys, but you just like go from one place to another. You You make friends, but you can't really like nurture relationships with people. And now I'm like, you know, we're all in places long enough to really like be able to like build new friendships with people and hang out and like you see them more than just like one day or one weekend every six months. Right. Yeah. Cool, man. Well, I'm glad that happened for you guys. Good for you for making that decision and letting off a little bit. And, um, uh, the, the results, I mean, perfect musically, the result of it was outstanding also in addition to, it sounds like a bunch of, uh, personal, uh, upside. So hundred percent well done. Um, what is, you guys are going to do a second off of emit time now, right? I think it's actually track four or five. 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 Track five. Call it a Super Bowl. All right. Yep. And we're not going to do the intro because... Oh, we're kind of doing the intro. Set the vibe. vibe.
nothing that's worth keeping Should I keep it all inside? I could go back to the beginning But I'll enjoy the ride Yeah, that's great, guys. Thanks for coming and doing this. And have a great show on Friday. You're at the Disc Jam Music Fest in Steventown, New York on Friday. Um, there's there's a handful of dates, not too many dates, because we know that overexertion is stupid and sucks, and you guys are doing like a, just the right amount of things this summer. There's the Peach Fest in Scranton, PA on um, July 26th. Uh, you're at the, the Workout Fest in Ohio, August 2nd, and there's a handful of Denver dates in October. Um, they'll all be announced at dopapod.com as more are announced. Hopefully there are not a ton more. Hopefully there's just some more, and it's a manageable amount. 
of more there. It, yeah. yeah. Um, so it. have a great okay. show. Travel safely. And guys, thanks for coming through and doing this. And best of luck on Emit Time as well. That just came out on May 24th. And thanks for playing music from it. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. for Thank you, thank you so much for having us. It was fun.